here at a hotel in Miramichi, where the inquest into police fatal shooting of Rodney Levi continues. The jury and Levi family members heard Levi's mental health history and his struggle with addictions. Forensic suicidologist Greg Zed has 45 years of experience. He testified suicide by cop is determined by nine factors, and in his opinion, Rodney died by suicide. But no one can know for sure. Rhoda Levi, Rodney's sister, was outraged. His life mattered to us, but they didn't give him that opportunity. He was just another, in their eyes, just another dead Indian. That's it. Just another dead Indian didn't deserve anything. Didn't deserve the compassion, the care, the understanding. Retired Dr. Linda Hudson started treating Levi for his addictions in 2002. She was heartbroken when she heard of Levi's death. Because I knew he struggled. And, uh, you know, I could see him spiraling down and that was difficult to see. Especially when I knew that, you know, at the basic level he really wanted to be free of his addiction. Coroner John Evans informed the jury the inquest is to present the facts and expertise to provide context. Rhoda Levi says the inquiry has been stressful. That's so hard. I, I can't believe it. I, I'm really hurt. I'm really hurt. We lost our brother, our, our uncle. Our, you know, it, it's, it's difficult. He was a human being. He was loved by everybody in our community. He was struggling and wanted help and he wanted to better himself. The inquiry will continue tomorrow with more testimony. Angel Moore, APTN National News, Miramichi, New Brunswick.